Welcome to Resident Evil Code Veronica X. I'm Steve. And I'm Moist Um We have just gone down to the depths of the underwatery place and we have a biohazard card. <laughs> and you said we could be going up against a boss soon. We could be going up against... I think we've got some mini bosses in our way, certainly. Um, access contoral symptom. Oh shit, system. yeah. System. Uh, I saw a key card shining in silver. You can use this to access the military training facility. Notice, ah, that... caution, can't read a bloody thing. Yeah, we're not in good health, are we? We've been bitten up a bit. You know, we've already fucked a ranking by saving because we're doing this as a let's play, so who gives a f you know? Alright, now, you remember when we were playing Resident Evil 3, there was the giant beast called Gravedigger. Alright, and I said it was based off of an earthworm. <gasps> right. Yeah, it is actually based off of, I believe, a millipede or centipede. Right. And this next creature we're going to meet is based off of an earthworm. It's called a gulp worm. A gulp worm. A gulp worm. Oh, you're going to bite me off the off, aren't you? No, you oh, fucker! Uh, into whoa, Kyo! No way! That was at least something that was worth the damage. Next generation. Yeah, I think that's like the only occasion where you can do something like that. Oh, fire burn! Step into fire. Ow, ow, Get ow, off ow, me! Ow, nasty, nasty. Knock his hat off. I don't like the amount of damage we're taking from being so reckless. Now, to be fair, this boss, we are actually going to just walk past it. Because we'll okay. deal with it later. Okay. Will we see it? Yes. Yeah, just just consider it optional boss. Oh, hey, buddy. That is the gulp worm. Which... Looks f fundamentally similar, right? Just less teeth. It does, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I believe I can fly. I believe I can fly. I believe I can pick up the bow gun arrows. Oh! oh! Holy moly! Shit. This thing's probably gonna fucking eat me. Right, get in there. Now we're safe. Now we don't have to worry about that ever again. Yeah, the f uh, yes. Because that's how Resident Evil works. Our first red herb. And we're not going to be able to fucking do it with it. Oh yeah, we haven't seen it yet, but you know, unlike previous games, you actually have to pick up the herb to use it. You don't have to in this one. Right, yeah, you mentioned that. Yeah. Uh, a couple of uh, se 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 seasons ago. Seasons ago. This is like season four uh, season of the Resident Evil Let's four, Play? Season yeah. Um, okay. Anything in here? Cages. There is. Cages. What was in this? Oh. Cages. <gasps> hey! A gun of bow. But you said it was pretty shit in this. It is. There is a file. There is a file. Memo on the pass on the pass number. Yeah. The emergency door lock system in the bio bio biology experiment. The, the emergency <laughs> door lock system in the biology experiment. experiment why can't I say that? The emergency room door lock can be released with the four digit pass number. Hope you haven't forgotten about that already. <sighs> I have just received an order from the system administrator requesting us to change the pass number periodically. What bothers me is that you often lose important memos, pass numbers, or even chemicals. So, in an attempt to solve that problem, I came up with an idea. You know the red human skeleton picture at the back of the biology experiment room? I have decided to use the number signed on the picture as the pass number. If you happen to lose the memo, just look at the picture. Well, I don't think you would ever need to use the emergency pass number anyway, but just in case, now you know. Take it take it easy, Mr. Careless. There again, with those files and their passive-aggressive tone. Yeah, they love that pass ag. Emergency, door lock system activating. The bio experiment room. Abnormal air. I can't enter the pass number. Okay. Abnormal air. <laughs> oh, That's can't. what happens when I fart. <laughs> There's abnormal air. Fills the room. There's a painting. I'm in there. Oh, shit. What? Shoot the glass! I can't get the door open! Shoot the glass! Shoot it! Kill you. What the? Something smushed that man big time. There appears to be no one around. A red picture is hanging in the back. I can't see the number from here. Uh, skeletons. Edit Steve, do a zoom and tell me if you can make it out. Enhance! Yeah. yeah. CSI that shit. Where they can zoom in and maintain visual integrity. That does not happen. Ever. Ever. You just have to use long words like anomaly. Contamination detected. And quantum. Level three. And bio contamination biological contamination three. detected level three. Okay, well, I mean, that, that's a. I think that's fine. I mean, that's. Yeah, fine. We're gonna get stuck. Oh no! Skewered. <laughs> we made it. We, we I'm proud of you, James. Well, her, her and her poopy hair, we made it. 
Her and her poopy hair. Yeah. It's not that bad. I mean, look at a ponytail. Man. It's like it, a piece it, of poop. It's not that bad. It's, it's a big drooping poopy. <laughs> I don't like the fact that this is clearly the, the HD re-release on the consoles and she has a different actual in-game character model to what she does. That's a different face entirely. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Because yeah. they can't get the they can't get the pixel thing. They can't squeeze it's the same really fourth, though, to be honest, man. Right. I get oh, the... that reminds me. The fucking title screen. Yeah. Chris looks nothing like he does. <laughs> what, in the, pre- in, yeah, in the original? Nah, he, he's, he's older now. Like, by older. three, he looks three like... months. He's three months older. Yeah, I mean, the, in that in the title screen of this game, he looks about 30 years younger. <laughs> you got to remember, by the time of the... I mean, you, your most, most experience with Chris is Resident Evil 6, right? Or 5. 5. 5. Six. Yeah. yeah. That's, like, a good six, seven years, at least. See, yeah, so like Resident Evil 5 is how I remember it. Yeah. And like, and Resident Evil 5 is how, is the most likeness to him in number one. Oh, I map, map of this building is shown on the monitor. It seems to be printed out. Yes. Print. 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 Print has existed before the internet, believe it or not, children. Hey, guys. <laughs> map for the and, training facility. And for some go. reason, it's still fucking expensive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Just, just fall. Thank you. Like, oh. uh, here's another rant, Steve. <laughs> oh god, here we go. Okay, now I was just at MCM London Comic Con, okay? And they managed to, for free, right, okay. print out a photo of me. Some woman stood in front of me and she grabbed me into her booth. I said it was like ECBM or BBM or something. Right. She said, do you want a free photo? Right, and, she, and I said, a free photo? Fuck yes, thank you. Yeah. Right, and then she said, uh, so where, where are you from? Are you from like Jurassic Park or something? Guys, I'm dressed <laughs> up. As Ellen Ripley from the, a- from the Aliens uh, franchise, and um, this one of these lockers open, surely. And yeah, she made a free photo, right? Wow, what? She made a free photo. It looks really good. It's high def, right? And they were giving it out for free. Why are printers so fucking expensive? It was they're just giving away photos. Simple lock. I don't understand. You're just, you're just upset at MCM in general. Can I just combine this? Yes, it's like the grenade launcher in Resi. Fucking yeah, brilliant. So they didn't fix it. No, well, that, that, I think that's meant to happen. I should. Okay. I need to keep one pack of these bogan bolts spare, one specifically. Yeah, right? guy. If you like, if anybody, if any entrepreneurs watching this channel, you know, like, <laughs> know any way to actually make printers cheaper, so like we don't have to go through like sixty to eighty pounds every six months for a printer. Appreciate it. Fuck. Like we have to basically buy a brand new printer every six months, right? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can't believe you're ranting about this. I mean, printers, man, they're really useful. Right? They're still bloody expensive. Yes, that's true. But right now, we could die. No, I don't give a shit about her. Claire. Claire, she's doing fine. I like Claire that and poopy actually... hair. I like, I like Claire a lot more than I like Sherry, but... <laughs> oh, okay, right, we've had a total of four protagonists so far. Who's rating on the fucking protagonist scale obviously, for you? Obviously Rebecca is the top one. Well, she Technically she's not a protagonist though, I is she? I don't care, she is in my head. Okay, well, you know, I, I let's try the bogan out Ooh. before we get into an argument. Uh, uh, Ooh. Yeah, that, that Ooh, just, just does upset him. That just made him angrier. It looks like he's got a lollipop on. Like, it looks like he's sucking a lollipop. Yeah. <laughs> Oh wow, this is wow. They're just putting fucking down this. Okay, what is this good at? Uh, eventually you can upgrade it with exploding bolts and then it will kick ass. Okay. Now I'm down. I'm down. Oh, the, the regular bolts are just kinda like there as entertainment value it seems. We need a fucking first aid spray. I don't there wanna use that. Interest. There is nothing left. There is nothing of interest. This is clearly a locker that's a jar! There is nothing of interest. There is nothing left. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing of interest. <laughs> oh. Finally. There's nothing of interest. There's nothing left. There's nothing of interest. He's probably a problem. It's, it's throwing fucking Bogon at us as, as if it's like the shit. It's just basically, here's another pistol. Right. But, I mean, it, it's worse. It, it Objectively. Seems to be, anyway. Because, like, the pistol has some back, like, kickback to it for them, right? Has uh, some... It can stagger them. Yeah. Like, that water looks really good. It's not when I step into it, I promise. Oh, okay. I think it looks better than the uh, PS2 version, though. Are these the Angelus, by the way? Yeah. Okay. I think so. They're just like proper, like nude, half rotted corpses. Army of Angelus. Yeah. Any. You want an Army of Angelus? Mm. Sauna. There's a yeah, lot of hot air inside. Pl- well, <laughs> well, I'm glad you're on the ball there, Claire. Well, at least it isn't abnormal air. Uh. Oh, no, 
they changed it. The um, there was like a very PS One floaty render that would like bubble the water around. Oh, and it looked weird. Yeah, they just removed it and made it a flat texture, which technically is a bit naffer, but I'll take it. Still looks good. Did that do anything? <gasps> there is a glowy, glowy, glinty, glinty, a glinty, glint. glinty thing. I don't know what that button do, but we'll find out in a second. Key with tag. Key with tag. Thank God we have the key with tag. <laughs> key with tag. All right. What does a key with tag have key on with it? Tag. A small key made of steel with the word storage. That's handy. Where? Where's the? It does not say storage at all, Claire. You're lying. <laughs> Stop lying to everyone on YouTube. You and your poopy hair. Oh, a device to control the water current that's broken. Brilliant. So we got out of that was a key with tag. I don't even know where I use it. Boo. That we've gone to that point of the uh, Resident Evil series playthrough. We've got to the point where I don't know what the fuck I'm doing anymore. <laughs> That's a risk. He that... does. He does know what he's doing. I... <laughs> Vaguely. <laughs> you know, I, I know how to shake Fake it until you make it, Steve. That's it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where do I use the key with tag? <laughs> where do I use you... key with tag? <laughs> silver card. Right, we've got a silver card. Yes. Okay, can we shut this siren up? It's, it's annoying me. Silver reader, silver call, ventilation, the room is not going. Oh, for fuck you then. Ah. Maybe you can, like, like in the movie, you can just bang it. Oh, sh um, What? No! What? Now we have stalked. We are stuck in this place. No, we're not. Well. No, we're not. Okay. I've been here, Steve, with f three games. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's this fucking. It's Alfred. Alfred Ashford, not Alfred. Alfred. <laughs> he's a bit. He's a bit naff, isn't he? he? Yeah, he could do with actually using the sight as opposed to the laser scope. Wait, <laughs> using the sight. <laughs> oh, we can't get you on stairs. No. Right, I he, he legged it. <laughs> oh, did he? What a pussy Alfred is. <laughs> Alfred Ashford. Oh. No, I'm like the master of this base. It's got a little horsey on it. Yeah. The hearts are going. <gasps> the pads are vibrating. Why was that happening? I don't know. <laughs> there are piles of bullets. Oh, I ah, my. Oh, uh, mate, it's like that's a that's a that's a sodi a sodi cop a sodi pop vendor. Yeah. There, right? I bet you the cans from that are like forty pence, right back then. Oh, what well, two thousand. Oh yeah, man, I remember when pop wasn't extortionate and no yeah. sugar tax. Yeah, now like, for some reason, here's another fucking <laughs> moist owl and fucking rag. Why is Pepsi Max Diet Coke, right, Coke Zero, why has it got a sugar tax on it? Because the Tories are bastards. I mean, um... Why has it got a sugar tax so it's got no sugar in it? Guys! Hemostatic medicine. <sighs> Right, I know, I, not not to cut your rant short, <laughs> but I think we need that. And I feel I'm gonna feel safer if I switch my guns up. Uh, I I feel like I'm over equipped with stuff though. Uh, I do love the sprites in this game. They look sweet as fuck. <sighs> do, do I need you? Like unlike the past kind of three games where they've started reusing them over and over again and not only that but you, you kind of looked at some of the sprites and they didn't really look like what they were supposed to be mm. <laughs> but it's time to break out the good shit uh, look, yeah. look at that like, little like, wrist action at the end there mm. like, uh, I, mm. they sound piddly as fuck by the way but they'll do the job I mean as long as they shoot fast I don't care and they're, they're as fast as pistols go oh really yeah. Go, oh, that, I thought they were machine pistols. No, they're not machine pistols. Wow, they really like closing doors. <laughs> what the fuck? Consider the area you are in. Well, he really did sound like what I did. Yeah. Yeah. Playground. I <laughs> just for you. Please try and keep me amused. And do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. He sounds like a good lay. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. You know, um, I used to be really hard on Code Veronica, but Alfred's warping me back up to it. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Um, uh, he's he's not comedy god. Oh, God, just open oh, the fucking oh, door, Claire. Oh. Is, it, is it a mimic? I don't think we do those. We're just... We have a pad that's vibrating in my hands in the slowest. All right. 
It's a shame. I think the door models are a little blur. blur. Why? Why did? It... Oh, maybe this is a big area then. <gasps> oh, Uzis. There is a submachine Holy gun. Holy crapiolis. It isn't loaded. Take the submachine gun. Will you take it? Yes. There is ammo for the submachine gun. gun. <gasps> it, it went clockle. What is that? Fucking... This is a... Oh my god. It's, ah. it's a minion from Despicable Me. That's not bad. <laughs> it's a bit worse than that. It's called a Bandersnatch. Really? Yes, that's its name. Oh, you have those in D&D. &D. Yeah. He looks really fucking good. Like, Can I just leave? The door is locked. I no, can't open it. You what may... the fuck? Right. Let's go for it. You may not leave. Oh, he's going to keep... No, he's like fucking... Stretch Armstrong. Die! Bloody giant <laughs> yellow bastard. He got, he got bandersnatched. Ugh. What are we waiting for? Alfred, fuck you! <laughs> I just expect him every time we do that. <laughs> oh, there's another one. <laughs> ah. Squeeze the head. Oh, mate. Do you know what film came out around this time? Die Hard. No, no. The Matrix, you oh. lemon. Right, yeah. Nice. Stop trying to look cool, Steve. There's no way there's that many bullets. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, yeah. Don't worry, Claire. Your knight in shining armor is here. Shut the fuck up, Steve. I I'm hate sorry. you. I hate you, Steve. Yeah, get it. Get you it. You wish. Get it. Get it. But thanks for the help. Kick him in the nuts. See? Kick him in the nuts. Take his bo bollocks. Back. Whatever. Here. Take these. Oh, she's very angsty. Isn't she? Machine guns? For me? You oh my know God. the deal. Machine in guns? Exchange for your Lugers. <laughs> Okay, okay. Oh my god, let's go. <laughs> We've got the empty gold lugers. <laughs> this thing is too cool. Thanks, Steve. Yes. Now this is my kind of weapon. All right. Ha <laughs> ha, get <Huh>? fucked. <laughs> Got him. This thing's empty. You cheated me. Up there, plenty of ammo just for you. Way up there? Give me a boost and I'll get it for you. I know, it's pretty hard in a Resident Evil game just to climb. <laughs> Ow! My back! Yeah, fucking... <laughs> <laughs> straight into yeah. his back. It's nice that pretty much you have the reaction most of Resident Evil fans have for Steve Burnside. <laughs> there's, a, there's a select few who still wish he was still around, but generally not liked. What? Now that your just knight a... has made his appearance, he can join you in your descent into <laughs> death. <laughs> Someone's got a taste for the theatric, eh, Alfred? Ooh! Yeah, he's just a bit of a bell, isn't he? Okay. Yeah. Steve is. Let's do it! Oh my god. Wait here, Claire. <laughs> the worst part Time right now. Test out my new toy. <laughs> I can't stop laughing at this guy. He's so bad. Oh my god! Let's go forward! I'm gonna protect you! Oh yeah! Oh um, You knew wow. exactly what was coming, right? <laughs> the, you, the, the game lets you play as Steve for 10 seconds. Anyone else? There is there is someone here. Right, so we got any trivia about this guy? Uh we're about to find out a little bit more about his backstory. Alright. Uh it's it's uh there's a weapon in there, shotgun. It's a grenade launcher. Oh, is it? It's yeah. a grenade launcher. This is actually one of the few Resident Evils where a shotgun is fucking very late in the game. Oh, like, well, very... shotguns are fucking powerful. Yeah. Especially against living things. Um, or undead. Yeah, or, or undead. Just just things. Yeah, just thing in general. I mean, the Uzis aren't doing a bad shout, to be honest. Anyone else in here? There is a handgun part placed on the desk. It Ooh. cannot be used with a submachine gun. Therefore, Steve does not give a fuck. I wish someone would bite him. Repeatedly. That's probably gonna happen, to be honest. I mean Oh, I don't look good. He's he's got 
He's got qualities. I'm not going to say redeeming qualities. What? What qualities? But, he, uh, I, you know, he can shoot things. Like, you know, I'm currently using him he, as a craft cleaner be, for Claire. He would, he, he's the annoying sub-protagonist in, in an anime. Oh, God! He's Yamcha! <laughs> yeah. He's, he, exactly. He's the one that thinks he's all it, but, oh, there's a face in the wall. Fuck me, it's Steve Burnside, the Yamcha of Resident Evil. It was dirty work, but this area is now clean. Oh my god. And this case, case is now closed. See, you can depend on me. Yeah, you see, same. This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. Yeah, that's not his shoot then guns. people? <laughs> okay. Uh-oh. Steve. What were you doing here? Now you ask. Who brought you here, and where is your family? My mommy Shut did. up! I don't want to talk about it! Don't waste the bullets, you knob. Steve. He's not much your. Never mind. And he has Let's issues. Let's going. I mean, you know, everybody's got their issues, you know. This is true. Steve Bumside has... Uh, <laughs> He's just, he's just watched way too many anime. Not there's anything wrong with anime, guys. I am, I, am, well. I am also one of the like the most fanboyish boys of anime. Hey, we, we, uh, he's like super anime. This guy. Blue card reader. I, I did. I, to be honest, being honest, I did like their little uh, their little thing there. When uh, she swapped over the thing and she laughed about it. Yeah. That's mostly because Claire laughed. I like Claire. I don't like Steve. <laughs> <laughs> if only. If only Steve Bumside wasn't so heavy. Yeah. Oh boy. We're in trouble. Oh, <laughs> that Claire, looping sound. Are you okay? Does it look <clears throat> Steve, behind you. My Ankleth is trapped. Oh. Hey, it's Hitler. It's Hitler. No. It's Hitler. It's gonna get you. Slowly. Just hit him around the head with your heavy gullet Uzis. What's wrong, Steve? Shoot him! Is that his dad or something? Mm-hmm. Really? Yeah. That's his fucking dad! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you heard it here first, everybody. No. Steve's dad is Hitler. Steve's dad is Hitler. Hashtag Steve's dad is Hitler. Oh no! God no! Wow, Steve's dad is lazy. Wait, he had a collar on. Yeah, prisoner. Father! <laughs> Holy shit! Ah! Poor Claire, she's gonna be covered in his dad's guts. <laughs> and it's still twitching, which means there's still part of it functioning. Steve. My work. Should do. <laughs> Father. Father. <laughs> Father. I've been calling some really weird things. <laughs> like things that are just right on the button. I don't know how I've been doing it. Dad. I used to work for Umbrella. I tried to steal information. Intending to sell it off to the highest bidder. He was caught. Mom was killed. And we were sent here. Oh, Steve. He was a fool to do something so reckless. Oh, Steve. So stupid. So, Claire has got some. Those are some high waisted jeans. Yeah. yeah they go. Over the belly button, <laughs> like underneath the ribcage. It's okay, now. Just it's okay. your dad is dead. It's fine. You put four hundred fucking rounds into him. You just wasted all the fucking ammo, knob. Well, we didn't need those SMGs anyway. It's under repair. It's not though, is it? <laughs> it's not. Like everybody's dead. Uh, is there a thing? I'm trying to remember. A large size mm. relief. The imagery appears to be telling a legend. 
Okay. You share it. You want to share it with the rest of the class, Claire? Yeah. Or maybe you have to click it fifty times uh, before you know. A lift. The battery has been removed. Oh my god! Is it going to give you anything? Uh, um. First, the jeep is under repair. Have we got any bullets, man? Uh, wait. Let's. let's maybe you can throw Steve. Well, just throw him through the wall. Just throw him into something. Oh great! Oh oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Wait! 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 Whoa! 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 whoa. All right. I'm out enough of your fucking shit. Stay dead. That's a fucking tank, dude. Uh, you know, during a zombie apocalypse, perhaps a good weapon yeah. to utilize would be a tank. You need to. Can you not? Okay. I I I want to really. You know, Daddy would like a tank. All right. I don't think there's a lot I can do with it right now. This could be something around Alfred's tastes. But apparently this room, all I did was unlock that door, which gets us back into the complex from the other angle. Um, but there's not a lot to achieve there now. I've got hemostatic medicine. I picked that up from the bench. That will be helpful with Rodrigo. Right, yes. Because he needs it. Is there a, Can I get up at the... The hat? Oh, 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 he's got some h gun bullets. Better than having no gun bullets. So, yeah, I'll, I'll have that. Uh, anything else? No, right. Okay, I think there's a all door. All right, Steve, you're going to have to go over your dad dying. Come uh, on. We need to get out of here. Oh, God, no, it's not parenting again with Moist Owl, is it? It is. He needs to get over it already. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, everybody's lost their dad. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> you know. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I know we don't like the guy, but sympathy for the dead a little. Shut up, up in-game Steve. <laughs> in-game Steve. <laughs> what about out-of-game Steve? Is he... Ah, oh, you bastard! Oh, shit, he went straight for the neck. Why did he always go for the neck? I don't know. Why do I always shoot in the crotch? Is that, like, is, it, is that the softest part? <laughs> it's the easiest part to crit. Yeah. <sighs> Anyone in here? Ah, another save room. And a, I know where I can put that. Oh, look, shit. That's the thing that you need to put at the top of the thing. Mm. Uh, Agreed. At that place. <laughs> and now we have to, at, at that place. <sighs> <laughs> I'm glad we're on the ball here. Yep. Right. I There's only one place to go. go. I'm on it. Just <laughs> got it going on. Can we go this way? Has Steve got over here? He's not going to be available for us for a while. Okay, that's fine. Do actually. we? Do we really care? No, I, I don't. Say. I was just going to like if it, if we like happen to pause because of him, then that would that would displease me. Apparently, all the bikes in the local area are around at the minute. I oh yeah, yeah there's a lot of room brooms happening. Blue card. Fucking man, it busted. Fucking get him. You know what would be great right now? Hmm? Not having apparently the Motorcycle Society outside the recording studio! Oh, right. I'm sure they can't hear it. I am lost. Comment in the sections below if you can hear it. I'm going to up the volume just to prove myself right now. Hashtag Steve's dad is a hit. Is Hitler. Oh my god! Oh. Is it Hitler? No, my dad's lovely. <laughs> Do you mean Steve Burnside's need, dad? Of course I need yeah. to mean Steve yeah, okay. Burnside's dad. Oh. I'm not even... Why met, did you... I'm not even you've met, never got the moustache or anything. I've not even met your dad. Oh, yeah. He looked like he was in a military uniform and he had like it's a... It's a prisoner out! looked like he had a crop cut. And oh, my God! Well, I just shaved the tash off. Could have had a tash. You don't know. Surprisingly, this is actually the Wolfenstein follow-up you weren't expecting. Oh, look, Steve, he's still dead. Woo. Jesus, get up. <laughs> You're embarrassing yourself. Just get up, you know. <laughs> Stop crying. <laughs> oh, man. It's funny, because you know when we get to Resident Evil 6, guess who's going to play Sherry? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's that guy. I yeah. forgot about him. Yeah, fuck the golf worm. We're all right, we're all right. Is yeah. it? Is it gulp? Gulp. As in gulp L -L worm. Yeah, G-U-L-P uh, worm. Gulp worm. Right. There's a Rhinocon. There are so many of these locks that look exactly the same. Yeah. That's something that I'm not enjoying, actually. This Biohazard card seems to be a one-hit, one-trick pony for, like, every puzzle in the area. Although, the trade-off is, it's going to, you know, eventually wear out of uses. Please don't be like, oh, there is. There's always fucking something. Haha, <laughs> 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 shit, you can't uh, use you can't walls. Go stairs, walls? Knobs. You can't use stairs, Steve. <laughs> uh, Silly doggos. I, can't, I only just got... Oh, shit, man. Only Ooh, just fucking here. Is that another key? Yet another. That's the blue key card we could have done with like 10 minutes ago. Oh, okay. And I'm going to use it. I think I'm going to use this silver key for the second to last time. That's another horsey. Mm hmm. It's that area where we were initially in. Okay. You know, you, you know what I'm saying? Maybe. 
Maybe. So, yeah. Maybe we'll see what happens when you actually get through and I go, oh yeah, I remember. Oh yeah, the 40 pence cans, yeah. Yeah, the 40 pence cans. <laughs> yeah. Oh. So we've, we've seen the really cool looking Bandersnatch and that's pretty much been it. That looked really cool. We have really got cool. the Lugas. Yay, it's the theme tune. We have got the Lugas, but I'm going to save them for now because that way we use them is another save room anyway. So, so are they good? But you can't use them as a weapon, they're a key for you. Oh, okay. And only uh, Mr. Burnside uses them as a gun. Right. Because he's a bastard. Do we need... I'm going to save that herb for the simple fact that I feel like I need more HP. Don't need to go in the box twice! Open up your Luger eyes, because I'm Mr. Bumside. <laughs> <laughs> Is it bad that I don't know the song, but strangely recognise it? <laughs> uh... Mr. Brightside. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Horsey. Now I'm going to go past the fucking dogs again. Yeah. You'll be fine. I'm glad that you're the glasses half full guy this time. Because it's It'll usually be... me who has to delude myself. I love, I love that they keep resting. They're like, oh, she won't be back. <laughs> yeah. like, I'm just going to rest here. Wait, there might be a shortcut thing I need to do in that area. I'm going to take a quick look. Oh, okay. All right, this will help Chris out. This will help Chris. We're, 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 we're playing like 14 million episodes ahead probably, but... Can I get? Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. Get oh, dog! Oh, oh, wow, that dog was frozen mid air yeah, for like was. forever. That was really good. Ah, right, it works out for me as well. I need to get out of here. There's a lot of moaning down here, Steve. I'm right, sure that... I like it. All right, that helps Chris out a little. Uh, oh, can I go this way? I can. Excellent. I have no idea why this is important. This is because there is a weapon we need to pick up. Oh. That the the Oh, this is where thingy yeah. right. This is where the girl launcher is. And, yeah. He gets it. By Jove, he gets it. And someone else is gonna fucking get it. Ooh. Oh threatening. <laughs> threatening. So threatening. Uh, it's threatening Steve. Do it's we <laughs> It's threatening my mind. <laughs> Uh, anything else? Anything else? The, the beautiful thing about Code Veronica, by the way, everybody, is that it does give you respawns if we fuck up, so I'm not too worried if we die. This is probably why I need to use the key. But don't, like, don't, like, try Super to die. Lot. I'm yeah. not trying to try die. To, like, try your best not to die. Would also be... Ooh. Chemicals. There's something there. I can't use it, apparently. Oh. That, that green... Look. Save them. Leave them for Chris. Chris is going to come through this area at one point. Right. So I might as well leave some stuff for him. I want to get them fucking acid rounds, though. They'd be great on my collectional shelf. Collectional shelf. There's words that you don't hear every day because they're not words. <laughs> I'm a little, a little flustered. Can you tell? <laughs> is it? Is, is the game? Is it? Is it getting to you? A little. A little. A little. Is it Steve Bumside? It's getting to you. Oh no! <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Stretch fucking Armstrongs. Oh, it's a scatter grenade, man. Okay, I can get around this shit. Wow, two shots it took to kill that thing. Man, eat shit and die. I want to know about, want to know more about those. <laughs> like, they are cool. Well, it's just the, the, that's the frontline basic grenade launcher as well. No, I mean the Bandersnatch. Oh, the Bandersnatch. I want to um, know, know more about those. They, right. They're cool. They, I believe, are an offshoot of the Tyrant program. All right. Still twitching. Yeah. I, I'm not, I, we might find out more about them later. Yeah. Sadly, I think it's only like Resident Evil 1 where it did that whole like slideshow with like model MA Summit Cerberus Neptune. I wish more of them did that. Mm, okay. You know, that whole slideshow. Oh, I know where this is. The online... Oh, the steel in that fucking room! It appears to be destroyed violently. It's possible the T-Virus leaked from here. Shit. Can we, can we go in? Can we smash it? <laughs> <laughs> Different context entirely, Steve. Don't go there. <laughs> Can we pound it? Right, take it anyway. And where else can I use this blue key? Um, near where bombside is. Up the elevator on that one floor we couldn't go to. Okay. Wonder if he's got over his dad yet. Probably not. It'd be nice if we get there and he's gone. So we don't feel awkward anymore. It would be nice, yeah, because we wouldn't have to keep on these constantly crying. <laughs> dead dad. Realistically, uh, if you've ever been bereaved by your dad, we're not, we're, you know. You, you, you're cool. You, you, you do you, all right? What? Uh, no, no, that's <laughs> not the same thing. Uh, We're talking about Steve Bumside's dad, uh, which is completely different to anybody else's <laughs> dad, okay? Yeah, it was Hitler. Because he was Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get this down? No. 
That's no, clearly. You can't, you can't go up there. Mm. Why not? Was there a gate there? Yes. Oh, I didn't see that. It, no, it's not a gate. It's a staircase that folds one way or another. I'm not sure which. Uh, Tooth. Tooth. Or broth. Broth. We're, we're on broth. <sighs> now, this is either the floor with the blue indigo card lock or it's the... Are we, are we done a good? We have done a good. Hey, you did it. Good Are you memory. proud of me? Good memory, Steve. Oh, lo and behold, it's the fucking undead. Oh. You no longer need the Emicon. Yes! Oh, wow, that guy doesn't even do anything. That's so funny. Uh, it's just... <laughs> oh, there's a glowing thing. Uh, the Albanoid description. A creature which is created by injecting the Teed virus into the genes of a salamander. Characteristics. Oh, similar to a normal amphibian, an albinoid's body will change as it grows with age. When young, an albinoid is small in size, but it can grow to over seven feet in a very short time frame, ten plus hours. They possess high mobility and are able to discharge electricity. These characteristics are most notable when they are underwater in their adult form. I like the little 3D model we got. That, that was like, here's backstory on a boss. Yes. Oh, really? That's a boss, eh? Yeah, it's a boss later on. She. Oh, yeah. I get the feeling I should be saving these bad boys, but we, we, we have, uh, we, we've, we have we've established the grenade launcher. Various commands may have been given here. Is this Alfred's chair? All right. You keep saying his name wrong. Oh, yeah. Alfred Ashford! <laughs> that zombie does not seem to be, like, walk aroundable. He can't walk over him, so he's going to... He's, he's going to come up. Yeah, he's going to activate. I can feel it. Just take this herb right now. He's going to transform. <laughs> you know Keith Thacker? Yeah. Shout out to Keith Thacker. Um, he does a really good Transformers impression. Have you heard it? Uh, just ask him next time. It's okay. really good. It's really good. This is where you go onto his channel and it's just... Ah, the code. Ah, this is how we find out. Can we zoom in? Can we enhance? Enhance. Ah, look at that butt. <laughs> he seems to be dead. Uh, Resume using the camera? Resume yes. using it. Wow, you have to. Okay. Okay. Oh, what is in this little crevice, though? I want to see. I want to see what's in the crevice right here. Vials. There's nothing special. Oh, Vials okay. of test tubes. <sighs> Someone's easily not impressed. Enhance. Ooh, well, one, one, two, six. One, one, There's Captain two. Jack Sparrow. You have heard of me. <laughs> the bio experiment room has uh, finished hey. that Oh, what a surprise, they're alive. Hey! And let's drop the stuff in the box. Box. I'm trying to think where we go now. Well, we could go to that room, 1126, the code, yeah? Yeah. Pretty sure. Well, did we see Here. the other side of that room, though, where that shutter door was? But that didn't have a code lock. It must have been literally where. The initial starting area, you know, where we like, this thing will close down in five seconds. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. We'll head that way. I'm gonna just drop off some stuff in the bulks because we're running out of fucking space. Fucking space? Fucking space. <laughs> Alright, don't need you two later. We need one more of you relief things. Thingies. I feel like rinsing these M100Ps because they are gonna be, once they're out of ammo, they're done, but they, they're alright. Dual wielded pistols. Like, are they. So they do double the damage then over normal pistol. I think it's just normal pistol damage. I, I genuinely think it's just the pistol, but twice the rate of fire, and you only have a percentage count on it and a hefty clip. Oh, a clip. A not, clip. not a clip, but a, a clip. 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 Yeah. Clip. <laughs> <laughs> I like how shit these dogs are. They Did you hear me? Loves going fate? around in circles. <laughs> 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 Oh look, it's me, it's me, it's me. That's dogs, that's their life. We, you know, this one episode, we've been in this corridor like 15 bastards. Oh, we times. have. <laughs> it feels like... Oh. Right, let's go, 1126, yes? 1126, 1126, 1126. We're locking it in, 1126. 1126. 1126. I'm the doorknob is Jack missing. Sparrow. I can't open it. Kick it open, Claire, just... Yeah, just like, like, you know, know like... I know you didn't see the tyrant do its thing in Resi 2 in our particular cannon, but it can bust a fucking wall down. I'm sure you can. You can, got the fuck, you can push a giant metal box. I mean, you're wearing high-waisted jeans. Yeah. Surely you can do it. 
That sounds really mer. Two. Six. That is such a mer noise. Oh. Beep, beep, beep. Just in case. What was in those cages? What was in those cages, Steve? Yeah. Uh, I'm guessing test subject. You could fit a human in there. Oh, barely. If you're cruel about it, what are Umbrella good at? Yeah. Being a bit cruel about it. Oh. Is this cutscene? No, this is just me. Oh, I thought you were oh, moving in very slowly. Yeah. Ooh, acid rounds. We've got banana flavour. Uh, they, they fuck up living targets. He's already dead. Or rather, non-zombie targets. Like hunters and shit like that. There's nothing useful. I love how out of place that fucking skeleton is. Maybe somebody escaped through the cracks. It appears to be alive. The capsule is labelled Baby Albanoid. Oh. You remember that place with the painting? Oh, okay. And the emblem? Oh, we're going to drop that off there. Oh, that makes really unpleasant sounds. Shoot it. Perhaps shoot it, Claire. Shoot her! <laughs> shoot her! Uh, oh, shit. Oh. oh, there's more of you! Oh, shit, there's so many of them. Make me hit the buttons! Holy fucking... I do not appreciate the clock going down while I'm going through a door. That's scary. 3, 32, 31. Don't. Don't, 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 29, don't do it. 26, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22. We got 21 seconds to go. <laughs> what I want to know is why there was only one old baby albinoid popped, right? One baby albinoid popped out. Yes. And then, and then we had then, a fleet of Then there was just like, yeah, because they used the old, uh, you know, the old RuneScape duping technique? <laughs> Go on, what's the old RuneScape duping technique? You drop everything on the floor and then you press Alt F4. What, crash the game? Quit the game. Yeah, because then you can steal the person's equipment. Oh, uh, you mean robbing people, right? No. It's duping. Oh, you mean... Uh, <laughs> not, not duplication, but robbing. <laughs> you know, five books not contained. <laughs> five books. Just... Okay, all right, maybe a little. <laughs> you know, it's... Oh, fuck. Fucking, fucking zombie no, bastards I, missed I, her. I, I'm being completely honest here. I never did that myself because I am pure boy. But I know a lot of people that did. You're Paragon, not Renegade. Yeah, okay. and they were bad people. Dun, 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 dun. It's just a very sassy skeleton, you know? Yeah. Okay. The gold key. The cold, the cold, cold, gold key. Anything in here? It's a cool... I really wish I had a fucking lockpick right now. Oh, I remember where I get the lockpick. There's some writing on it. Dedicated to the training facility something. Alfred, Alfred, Alfred. Alfred. This shotgun shell's in behind there. I can see him glowing, look. And a herb. <sighs> can we get behind this bad boy? Can we fuck? All right. Uh, all right. We, yeah, because you can't pull. You still can't pull in this game. It's a video game. You can you know only push. You know how it do. No pull. Only push. <laughs> get lost. At least these guys are a... Bit shit. You know, like dogs when uh, you you throw something and then they bring it back to you. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. Like, no take, only throw. No take. What's this for? It's for the storage room. <laughs> <That's it. laughs> Cheers, man. <laughs> uh, I think we need to go to the palace now. I memory says palace, but I want to go see Rodrigo first with that hemostatic medicine because I have a feeling he's going to give me a lock pick. Okay. Yeah. Sweet as. Fuck, because we need that. Yeah, we do, because I'm fed up of having... It's locked with a simple lock, and you can't do fuck all about it, Steve. Oh, fuck, I keep forgetting about this shit. At least he's, like, impressively not a threat. Like, I'm big and noisy, see you later. Muy deep. <laughs> Muy bueno. Molto bene. Where's the... There's no one around. Okay. Oh, he sounded, he sounded there, just stuff. like an NPC there. <laughs> there is no one around. There is no one around. Uh, we have the finest armor in all of Syria. <laughs> you know. Come get your armor. <laughs> Go on. What's your? Uh, okay. Obviously, you do D and D for like yeah, that's your bread and butter. Yeah, that's your uh, yeah. favorite thing. Yeah. What is the most NPC generic voice you can do? Like you know. Uh, it's probably whenever I do a guard. Go on, what's and it's just basically a, a slightly deeper my voice. Um, so give me a give me something fantasy-ish to say. Uh, your gold is no good here. Leave now. Um, maybe maybe a bit more if you want. Your gold is no good here. And I just I just I just go and slightly northern. 
<laughs> I always I always tend to go slightly northern England whenever I do an accent when it's when it's just an NPCs that they'll never meet again, and then sometimes it will be characters that they really like, so I have to actually expand <laughs> on their car- on their voice, which uh, is pretty fun sometimes. <laughs> so that they go from being a minor NPC to then a uh, a quest NPC. Oh, that yeah, that happens all the time, and it's really funny. It's really funny to uh, to to write up you know because the, there are so many characters that they the watchers specifically like they absolutely loved but they were only they were just like spur of the moment oh he's not dead okay what good what are you doing here he's been bleeding this entire time he's, yeah he's been bleeding out it's just having a little sleepy na- nappy time friends hemostatic medicine how kind of you yeah, you brought us here and locked in this hell island. But why not? We haven't said a thing. We just yeah, went in that Let me help you with that. There we Thanks, go. but I can take care of myself. Here's your magnum from F and V, mate. Please. <sighs> That'd be so Did nice. Me. Don't give. A gift from my brother. But... How are you going to smoke now? Thanks. Smoke is not bad. Don't. Yeah, oh. smoke, is no smoke is no good. Don't do. Smoke is no good. Don't do. Oh, go. this. This is like a shit trade, can I just say? We're, right, we have now elevated to the ability to unlock small locks. Also, I, just, I want to also point out that he said, uh, no, I don't need your help, and yeah, if we didn't, if you didn't get our help, you would be dead right now, okay? That's true. Right, this seems like an opportune moment to save, so tune in next time for when we hit the palace and see Castlevania. I've been Steve. Uh, Moist Owlet. Bye! Bye! What?